there will be a moment that many more people will buy an electric car with a sufficient range. We know those prices will come down. And then by that time, in a few years from now, the, the electric infrastructure should be ready. The goals are ambitious. We're only at the beginning. How can we accommodate the, the, the real growth that is uh, predicted? I think it's possible uh, because electricity is everywhere basically. But we're nowhere near fast enough. Rolling out charging infrastructure is a big supply chain question. You need EV drivers, the energy companies, the network operators, the card holders, the interoperability. You need everyone on board to really speed it up. We should proceed really fast, as fast as possible. In six years time, 4,000 taxis in Amsterdam should be electric. That's a factor of five more than we have now. A second major problem will be in city logistics. There's about 800,000 vans in the Netherlands and there's going to be a, a number of environmental zones where they, they cannot go in until 2025. Something I'm really excited about is electric trucks, really heavy electric trucks. The nice thing about heavy electric trucks is um, that they will actually be cost effective sooner than normal cars. Electric vehicles can help the urban situation, can help to keep uh, and the grid stable on a local level, but also can help to uh, make the energy transition possible on a national or European Global level. Stimulating charging infrastructure is actually much cheaper than stimulating the, the sales of electric vehicles. We have to be sure uh, about the standards and then we can develop business models based on these standards. There are millions of people crossing borders each day, so at least for the European Union it's uh, super important that we find uh, joint standards. So one of the ways to realize our goals is to ensure that roaming is possible for every uh, EV driver. And uh, that we enable this seamless charging experience independent of in what country you're charging. So we have the uh, project EV Roaming for EU, which is really about charging anywhere with a single card or with a single app. We have made great progress. And I think I think we actually need to focus now on the customers. What should we solve for them? Most people are afraid for change. Just bring it closer to the people. The end consumer doesn't want to know about standards or whatever. He just wants to be sure that he can use the car for the next ride. Ideally in a very seamless way, meaning you just plug in and everything else is automated. And that asks for a lot of technical personnel which is able to do that. We need each other uh, to really uh, make this, speeding up this whole transition towards electric uh, mobility. It's already complex and we're nowhere near where we have to be. So we have to run fast. <laughs>